But when it comes to makeup, it's out with the old and in with the new. But when exactly is the right time to replace those beauty products? Beauty expert Dora Vera shows what to look for when it's time to throw out your makeup. And we've got some proper storing ideas for you as well. Hi everyone, thanks for having me back. And yes, makeup does have a shelf life. It does not last forever. Um, the easiest way for you to determine how long a specific product lasts is by either looking at the product itself or checking out the packaging. Typically under the ingredients, you're going to see a little pot and it's gonna have a number as an M. So basically it'll have either three, six, 12, 18, or 24 M, which means months. And that will determine the amount of time that you can use your product. So for example, this is a cream blush by Glossier that I love to use on my clients and on myself. And on the actual packaging, the shelf life for this is about six months. So I'm not sure if you can see that, but down or up here, there is a little pot and it has a six and an M. So I know that I'm gonna have to use this before six months so that um, I'm not using expired makeup. Um, skincare is a little bit different. Uh, it could also vary. So this moisturizer by Tatcha is going to be good for six months. I have to use this within six months. If you don't use it within that time, um, you know, you fall into bacteria buildup, cross-contamination. Even though you are not a professional makeup artist, you still want to make sure that you're um, practicing hygiene and sanitation so that you are not, you know, um, getting bacteria onto your products and then putting them onto your skin, which could result in a breakout. Powder products are a little bit different than your creams or your lipsticks. Um, they are going to last a little bit longer. I would say between two to three years. However, let's just say for instance, this Kylie blush, their um, indication here is 12 months. So they want this to be used within 12 months. So every product is different. There are some lipsticks that you can use um, for a year. Or you, you know, these Milani ones, um, the shelf life of these are about 18 months. And so, also, so that you kind of preserve the formulas of your product. Storing is kind of a big deal. You want to make sure that you don't leave your products in the car because what happens is either one is super hot, your product will melt, the formula will just break up, or two, it's really cold and the product gets hard, which makes it harder to uh, work with. It's not as easy, especially if you leave your foundations in your car. Um, they're a little bit harder to work with. Now, that brings me to my next point about storage. Um, first, no cars. Second, I actually love to store my things in these acrylic containers. You can find them at Marshalls, the Container Store, Home Goods, any store like that that will have these. Um, in my opinion, these are amazing. I'm sure you guys have seen these online everywhere, but they really, really are helpful because you can separate your product just depending on like what you're using, what you like, and you can have skincare, lips, um, you know, brow products, whatever it is that you want. And then if you want a more like a minimalistic look in your vanity in your bathroom, you can just put it right under the sink. If you don't really care for it and you like to see your products and what you have, then just leave it right on top of the sink and it is just like an easy, you know, pretty little way to hold uh, your makeup products. And so I hope these tips helped and this information will give you a wealth of knowledge. Look back at all of your things and see what you have. Look at those little pots so that you know how long you have to wear your makeup. And if you're like me and you forget things, I'm sure you just put it on your calendar so that you know, you know, okay, I gotta get rid of this or you still have some time. All right, guys, if y'all have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me. You can find me on Instagram at the Look Studio HMU.